The wonderful Julia Harding and I have just finished spending two years, which felt very, very solid two years, revising the Oxford Companion for its fourth edition. Now, the third one came out in 2006, so that's nine years of wine world activity to try and get into this new edition. And boy, was it needed. We have revised over 60% of the 4,000 entries. Um, and in many cases, completely rewritten because the wine world has changed so much. I mean, you just got to think of how different the, 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 wine, the wine map looks even. You know, there are whole new producers in Northern Europe that weren't even able to ripen a grape back in 2006. Um, we have new, and techniques, I mean, the science of wine has advanced so much. So we have just hundreds of new developments to have passed on in the, the more scientific entries. The third edition of the Oxford Companion didn't even have an entry on the topic du jour, which is minerality. And we have completely rewritten all the entries on geology, for instance, and have long discussions on the relationship between vineyard soils, the rocks under them, and how a wine might taste, whether it, it, they're connected or not. Examples of, of whole new topics in the fourth edition are um, social media, for instance, and how, how they interact with, with wine. Um, Hong Kong, which has suddenly come on stream to be the world centre of fine wine trading. And then, of course, there's, there's the, the scourge of premature oxidation, which has ruined so many bottles of white burgundy, which wasn't really a big issue back in, in the time when we were putting together the third edition. But of course, we have a, a very long entry on it for the fourth edition. Orange wine, something that didn't exist. Um, back in 2006. We have 187 um, tip-top contributors from all around the world, whether they're academics or wine makers or practitioners or experts in their particular field. And over 50 of those contributors are brand new for this surely unmissable fourth edition. What we always want to do with each new edition is to provide the most up-to-date single volume, wide, re comprehensive reference for any wine student, and I know there are lots and lots of those around the world today, or wine professional or just wine lover.